Hi everybody, happy Friday! Um, it has been a couple weeks uh, since I have done a Coffee Date Friday. Um, I was just thinking, I don't think it was last, I didn't do one last week either. Um, I know we had a funeral of a friend of ours who passed away um, the one Friday and then Life, I think, just got to us. So, anyways, here I am again. I'm still battling with this respiratory thing um, that I have going on. Still coughing, but um, I'm feeling a lot better, so that is a good thing. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, this week went by crazy. I was actually just sitting here eating breakfast, and I realized that I don't think I've cooked once this week. Um, because we have gone out to the farm, I uh, had supper with friends, um, my husband was gone one night, uh, so yeah, it's been kind of a crazy, uh, busy week, uh, we were in Bismarck yesterday, so tonight, um, depending on whether or not it dries up, um, I may or may not have my husband home. Um, planting season started. If you didn't see um, any of my posts, we started last weekend. And last weekend, um, I spent most of the weekend home. Um, and I saw my husband maybe all but a couple hours. So they are about two-thirds done um, with planting wheat. And then yesterday we got like over an inch of rain, so um, that put a halt to planting things. And hopefully uh, this weekend they will be able to uh, get some more stuff done. But um, other news this week in social media has been just crazy. Um, I wrote a article for the Huffington Post um, called 10 Farm Wife Realities that it is farming season again. Um, and I am just blown away at um, how well that's been received and um, just how it's been making the rounds um, with lots of well-known uh, pages on Facebook and just being shared. So um, if you saw it, read it, commented, shared it, thank you so, so much. Um, it's been amazing. So that has been continually going on throughout the week. And then I was also asked um, by a website called Pink Tractor. If some of you follow Pink Tractor, if you don't, I would highly recommend checking them out. They are a fantastic um, website and uh, they run a really nice Facebook page um, that supports women in agriculture. And they interview uh, women in agriculture all across the board. So uh, they run a series called Amazing Women in Agriculture, and uh, they featured me this week. So I was really, really, really excited when uh, she contacted me to be featured. So that has been truly an honor as I take um, a stage with some pretty awesome women. So if you missed that, um, I will link that into here since I've kind of been everywhere this week. Um, as far as on the blog, um, I shared a, another fitness update and shared some of my favorite items that I use. I had some people asking questions about uh, protein powder that I use and um, I shared my recovery that I use, my favorite pants, my favorite shoes, and like the most amazing sports bras in the world. So if you're interested in any of those, um, I have that post um, that is up. And I also shared my beauty swap box um, if any of you are familiar with Crystal Cattle, if you aren't, I would highly recommend checking out her page. She's awesome, and she takes some pretty awesome pictures as well. Um, she runs a thing called a beauty swap, so basically she pairs two women up, um, from can be from anywhere across uh, the United States, and you get to um, kind of talk to one another, get to know one another, get to know what the other person likes, and then you put together a beauty, a little beauty box. And it can include samples. Um, the requirements is it only has to include one um, full-size item, but um, 
I've gotten several full-size items in a couple of my boxes. So to get an example of what came in my box from my partner, Mackenzie from Oregon, um, I shared with you guys and gave you a little uh, kind of review on some of my highlighted products um, out of my box. And Crystal Cattle has a link up for that. So if you're curious um, on what some people did or whatever, uh, everybody who participated is required to either blog or write a comment on Crystal's uh, blog about what they got in their box. So it's kind of like a link up party. Um, and if you're interested, Crystal just told me last night that she's thinking about doing another one probably middle to end of summer. So stay tuned for that. Uh, otherwise, that is pretty much it. Uh, we'll see what this weekend brings. I plan on doing my cooking show again this week. I think I'm going to do ribs, uh, pork ribs, and make some sort of homemade barbecue sauce. So if you're interested in that, I will be doing that tomorrow at 11 a.m. Central Standard Time. Have a great weekend, everybody. Bye.